G'day guys. I often get asked, am I a real butcher? The answer is yes. So in 1983, I started a butcher's apprenticeship and uh, 8,000 hours later, I completed it. Pretty much I've been doing it ever since. So I'm incredibly lucky that I get out to hunt seek a deer and then get to process them for a living. So this is my daytime job and um, when the weather's good, I'll try to sneak off for a hunt. Last day hunt was 14 days ago, and pretty much I've been uh, processing deer ever since. So hopefully in the next couple of days, the weather's gonna come right, gonna get out again, so. Well, good morning guys, it's the last weekend of June. It's out, got a tiny little weather window. It's been bloody near raining solid for about 10 days. So, Dangerous Dave and I and the Panther are up here for a quick bloody uh, day recce. See if we can catch a silly seeker out. <laughs> Coming up the track 10 minutes ago, we actually put one up in a little basin here that was sheltered and it squealed at us. I saw it in my headlight and that was about it. But uh, It's a tough looking day, it's blowing, there's the odd shower still coming through. So we've got to find some sheltered spots. Hopefully they want to get out of that wet bush. blowing down these gullies. It's nice here in the sun. <coughs> but I'm going to now get into this beach and quietly stalk through the beach. See if there's anything in there. Might just give this five more minutes. <coughs> Guys, that was a lucky one at 153 yards. Um, it was a hind and a yearling feeding up in these rocks over here. I may have accidentally shot the yearling where I was trying to get the hind. And what happened there was I zoomed my scope right into sort of full power. Temporarily lost the deer I was going to shoot and then possibly lined up on the yearling thinking it was the hind. But that somersaulted down into the scrub so we're just going to go and quickly check another spot and then we'll get down there with Annie and uh, go and recover it. There's plenty of sign on the faces down here so we'll just I'll keep my big voice down in case there's another one pokes its nose out. So 
we're just getting down the face to um, retrieve the first deer. And, uh, pretty confident we've, well, we have got it, we've just got to find it. So, a little bit gnarly down here. <laughs> Good on ya. Look at it, it's a monster. So these pair it looked bigger through the bino. <laughs> Jeez. It was definitely not the height. It wasn't I didn't sort of think I was rabbit shooting, but maybe. Well these spots are always worse than what they first seem. It's bloody steep down here. Definitely shot the wrong deer. It's bloody tiny. Never mind. We'll get up here. Regroup. Dave. Dave's dangerous has just smacked a kind of a non-typical looking stag down there. Um, Hundred percent sure he's whacked it. May have it on the GoPro, so we've got to get our asses down there. He's sort of lurched around into that gully and hopefully he's dead. So um, don't have a look, you're a killer. <laughs> so, so, and he's found Dave's stag. <sighs> Nothing is easy sometimes in hunting, so he's right down in there. Amongst the tightest crap. Oh my god. What is he? It's the ugliest head ever. Wow, it's in the, the coolest world. head. Wow, that's oh cool. Oh my god. Looks like that is a trophy. <laughs> that really is. That's the ultimate swishback. Look at that. That's like you had some deformed. Wow. Can you see that? Yeah, yeah, we can see that. Man. That's the most unusual head. Wow. He is so cool. He's just character. <laughs> Look at him. He's, he's like he's been riding his Harley at 150 bloody miles an hour all his life. What did we say he was? 120 yards? Yeah. Yep. Polk whacked him good. But he had to run down to this shit. Yeah, would have been nice where you were sunbathing, mate. Right? <sighs> Are you happy with that, Dave? I'm very happy. What a day. Yeah. Worth getting out of bed at three o'clock this morning. Absolutely. Well, it's about three, three thirty, and uh, we're heading back down the hill. We've got a bit of meat. An awesome day with, with dangerous. Um, that face where I took the shot, I was lucky enough to get a pretty cool um, seeker stag there a few years ago with my good mate Big A and uh, had my big STW then, pulled off a bit of a fluky shot at 650 yards across there. So Sometimes you get really lucky, sometimes you don't. Anyway, it's another fantastic down the hill. We'll uh, get back down to the truck. Dave assures me he's got a beer in the truck. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 